like a 45 minute show. But I made it, you know? Provide to the guest the first class we have each day. It's uh, painting pottery. We use uh, ceramic glaze. You know, if you want to build pieces, we have the first class at 11:30. That's a free form class, so any kind of piece you like to build up. Uh, on Tuesday and Friday, we have the schedule until that rest of the week.
Because of Alex, we're trying crickets. And, not just and it's in guac. It's not just crickets. We're not going straight crickets, we're going guacamole crickets. Yeah. Oh, and ants. Protein, it's all protein. All protein, yeah. That is very good. So we got upgraded to a swim out suite, which was very nice of them. Um, only thing I don't like is the two queen beds, but I get this one, he gets that one, he can snore if he wants. dumplings in here mm. like really good i went with the miso soup it's got noodles it's got white fish seaweed it's got all going on i never know how to do this ramen shit though you got the spoon anyway we'll it in your mouth. very tasty that's really good can't wait to get into the white fish so we came in every every resort has their uh tapanaki japanese and it's all been good this trip um in particular tonight the black cod was outstanding et's wife had the rock shrimp we had a couple of sushi rolls and we started out with uh, miso soup which is amazing totally outstanding and the pork dumplings pork dumpling was excellent and there was something else i'm missing but anyway i put the name of the uh, restaurant here at arte this is a good good spot it's Shilo, and it's for their restaurant I hope you like it. It's beautiful. What a bonsai tree. Thank you. It's a hundred year old bonsai tree I'm eating.
we are finally coming to one of the Ishkaret parks because we're staying at Arte and it is included in the cost of our stay at Arte. You saw the shuttle there. It comes at approximately every 20 minutes. But for your information, FYI, it, from Arte, they stop at Ishkaret and then weave their way through the roads. It take, took about 40 minutes to get here. No, it was probably 20. Uh, okay, half hour. Split the difference. But we're super excited. Super excited. What, what have I missed here? Uh, um, and, and then it goes on to the um, Explore and Census. Any ever parks you have to uh, make reservations. Right, so we, we were the only ones that got off the bus, so they were probably heading to uh, Ashaha or wherever. So, first time here, excited to show you. You saw, you would have seen us um, use our bracelet, and there's these little circles that you put your bracelet on there, and then there's, it's in a picture opportunity place. So then what's going to happen is the lights are going to flash, and then a camera is going to take a picture of you, and then you can then buy the package if you decide you want to buy the package. What they say to do is take as many pictures as you can, and then you can make that decision. And that applies to all the parks? Yes, so you have to buy, if you're going to do, like, so we have to decide if we're going to buy the Escaret Park one or not. At the hotel, I don't think it's a problem. But every park you go to, you have to pay for it. But So you only take two pictures, so you're not paying for two pictures. If you take 100 pictures, you're paying for the same price if you take two or 100. <laughs> Because we're staying at Escada Art, or Escada, it doesn't matter, um, we get to eat and drink free any, at any restaurant. Actually, for anybody, it's the cost of admission to get free food. food uh, it is, but we get certain different ones. The very beginning, and you'll notice there's three different roads. There's a little red brick road that goes someplace, then you have a black one, and then you have a white one. It's very mar well marked. So depending on what route you want to do, you pick the route. So we just found out that Escarat means the unknown, and we have no idea what we're doing today, so let's go. We are taking the boat down the Paradiso River. Last thing I can, we gotta be very quiet during this, so that's the last you'll hear from me. Up ahead, you're going to see an arch of Romeria. These flowers are related to pineapples. Company, but not for reproduction. <laughs> Mexican culture, the camels are used in altars for the Day of the Dead, influencing the nation, and it is the actual flag that we see here.
Yeah. The flamingos? So Kama said, when you see the male chasing the female with his feathers all puffed up, that means what he's trying to do, and picking her neck. That's a love thing. So far, very impressed at Escaret. This is like the Disney World of Mexico, except it's more sustainable. Very few mechanics involved. It's all natural. It's amazing. Look at these tree roots. And what does a tree root mean? Moshe and you. One thing I love and respect about the Mexican culture is they don't forget about their loved ones who have passed on. In fact, they have two days of celebration in November 1st and 2nd called, called uh, Selamo Dia de Muertos, where everybody gathers at cemeteries, they bring food, they eat the favorite food of the loved ones who have passed on, and they respect and love their dead. Canada and the U.S. could learn from that. And here we are at a cemetery. We're going to take you here as well. Let's check it out. This is what I'm going to do for DT's grave. See all the wine bottles? Or they could be tequila bottles too. Or maybe it should be for the drunken tourist grave. Oh, it is? That's to be it. It's a sun butterfly one. Mm.
great thing about Eshkaret is there are several restaurants on the property. I think what, there's four or five? Uh, five at Eshkaret, the park Eshkaret. Park, uh, Eshkaret Park, okay. four or five restaurants. Uh, and then three or four other places you can just grab a beer. Got a good cold Modelo and I need it. I'll tell you, be damned with Bush Gardens, Canada's Wonderland, and Disney World. Ish Garrett knows what they're doing. This is a fantastic theme park. You bring your kids, it's educational. It's educational for adults. I'm learning a lot. Seeing a lot, getting exercise with beautiful DT's weight. It's a great day, you gotta try it. Okay, so because we're staying at Arte, or es if you're staying at Hotel Escaret, we can go to, there's five different restaurants on the property here at Park Escaret that we can go to, no problem. If you bought a band, what happens is you can pick one restaurant that you can go to free of charge, and what they do then is they mark off your band, I want them to do that, so you only can go to one, so make sure you pick the right one. We're at the Mexican one, but down by the water, the beach, there's four more of our restaurants that we can go to. And we're right overlooking the Jaguars, we can see a Jaguar and a Panther right now. Okay, so that's the island of jaguars. And did you know a black one, all black, or a spotted one is still a jaguar? I just learned that. That is a wrap at a Garrett Parquet. It is so much more than we ever thought it was. It's taken us forever to get here because we don't have to pay for it. It's included in the cost at Eshgarit Arte. We thoroughly enjoyed this. We thought we'd spend two hours here. I think we spent, what, four or five hours, CT's wife? Lots to do. I'm gonna say bye to, bye to my buddies. They love me. They love DT. You guys take it easy. Let's go. I gotta tell you, one of the great things about this location here at Eshkari Arte is the Marin Ocean side, the little water side, because we got the Rio Grande right behind us here. We got a pool bar.
Okay. Are you paying in cash? Uh, pesos. Pesos, okay. 